Good morning everyone, my name is Saji and my sweetheart Karinas. Uh, we have this chance to have another weekend with you. We are going to have a nice camp in a spectacular place uh, in the northern part of the Iran. So, two days, I don't know, I'm here at the end of uh, July 2021. Okay, just Follow us and uh, keep in touch. We will share our nice moments with you, with our friends. And uh, I hope you like it. And leave a comment for us. We are so happy to have you comment for our trip. I know it's not a good thing to speak while you are driving but there is no choice okay the difference in this trip is the weather according to the forecast reports uh, now the north is raining and uh, it's so cold even in summer that's the uh, make north different in Iran uh, most of people uh, remember Iran with deserts with uh, uh, what can I say, with uh, people who live in desert, and, but the north is completely different. It's uh, rainy all around the year, very green, full of forest, very nice Caspian Sea. And I think we will have a very serious challenge in this program, in this trip, because of weather camp while it's rainy or very cold it's a it's a difficult experience but not for us okay i think we will meet our friends in half an hour
name is Saji. Today is July 30, 2021. Now we are in Shomal, which is a Farsi name for the northern part of Iran. As you can see, it's a beautiful spot right here next to the river. And I want to tell you something about this forest. This forest is a Hyrcanian forest. Hyrcanian forest is a natural world heritage site which has a very, very old trees, about 10 or 20 million years old. So last night we camped at this beautiful spot. Here was rainy, but it was beautiful and very, very fantastic experience. The scenery is so nice. Uh, it's cloudy sky and the, it's, it's so beautiful. There's a river. Okay, here is a good example of the Kenyan forest, a UNESCO World Heritage uh, natural site. As you see, very old trees. According to the UNESCO reports, here is the oldest forest on the earth. Very, very beautiful place, full of tall and high trees. It's amazing. But, and the sad thing is, you can see some people just threw their plastic and rubbish here. And I hope one day comes that we can find enough plastic in nature 